I will uh, demonstrate quickly, uh, because it can be done quickly, a, uh, a configuration of uh, a um, Motorola, tele Motorola uh, XTS, uh, the handset, and a cell phone connection. Uh, and uh, I've connected them, as, as indicated earlier, when a remote radio user uh, talks on the Motorola radio, uh, there uh, will be an indication on the ICRI of their voice uh, by the LEDs uh, that are associated with that particular port. Uh, have an associate uh, give us a test count. You may have noticed that uh, that audio was coming through the handset. Uh, that I was holding in my hand. Uh, handset, by the way, volume control is external, and this is a waterproof pot or potentiometer, and the selection for that handset is a, uh, in terms of talk group, is external. Uh, it is a waterproof switch as well. Uh, they are over here in this uh, corner. Now, if I speak back to the, to the my assistant, then it will go through this. It will. I will key this radio, which I hope will be visible. Audio test one, two, three, four. I am keying the radio connected to the ICRI, and it is being picked up by the remote radio uh, outside the view of the screen. If I have the Realm radio connected and any other radios, they would have all been keyed at the same time as the Motorola radio and transmitted to their specific uh, remote radios. Now, if you, uh, if I have someone remotely dial this uh, BlackBerry, then that uh, that call can be picked up if the BlackBerry is set for auto auto answer, then it, it will pass that information directly. Uh, now, if I go off hook, uh, I am now communicating via my handset uh, to both the Motorola radio and to the remote cell phone. If you have any uh, further questions or any questions, uh, please, uh, uh, at the end of this, uh, is uh, information to reach us. Uh, our tech support is 24-7, 365, uh, with very knowledgeable uh, folks at the other end of the, uh, of the phone. Uh, but well, you can email a question. Uh, the, that information will also appear at the end of this uh, briefing. Thank you.